Hello, and welcome to our Serenade video. In this video, we will go over navigating the new client portal. Let us log into the client portal. The homepage has been revamped with added information that the client can see. Additionally, they will see icons on the left, taking them to see and do different things. Let us go over some of these updates. First, your client can now see the cases you are working for them. Also, the caseworker can share case process steps, and in doing so, the client can see what percentage has been completed. If they click on the percentage, they can see those steps. Anything in green has been completed, anything in light green is being worked on right now, and anything in gray has not been started. The next thing they can see is a breakdown of cases by process type. For clients who have multiple cases like employers, this will be a good visual to see the different cases that you are doing for them. The next thing the client can see is My Questionnaires Forms. Here they will see any pending questionnaires and forms to fill out. If needing to work on these questionnaires, they can click on the mailbox to the left to take them into the area to answer and submit their questionnaires. If you have the optional module titled Messaging, they will be able to see messages here. To reply to these messages, they can click on the Messages tab on the left to take them to the area to reply or compose new messages. If you have the Billing optional module, your clients will be able to see any invoice that has been created for them. They can review these invoices by clicking on the Invoices button to the left, taking them to the area of Invoices. If having credit card processing, your clients can click the Select button and proceed to add a payment onto their invoice. Lastly, below they can see if any other member has questionnaires to answer. This means any member that is linked and has pending questionnaires can be seen here. This will come in handy for employers to see if any employees have not submitted their questionnaires. Now, we already saw what some of the sections on the left do. Let us go through the remaining buttons. The Reports button allows clients to be able to run reports. To use this feature, you must be signed up to Custom Reports, and you must have enabled a client to run a report in their Client Access tab. In doing so, they can come in and run reports at any time. The Share Documents button allows you to share a document with the client to view here. Additionally, your client can upload documents here and in doing so, goes into their client profile. Or if you share a document checklist from the case profile and they select it, it will transfer those documents into their case. The Shared Logs section allows you to share a log with the client where they can view it here. By default, logs are not shared. However, once manually sharing a log either in the case or client profile, they can securely view it here. The last couple things involve employer-specific functionality such as the ability to send questionnaires on your behalf and the ability to start a case. By sending questionnaires, it gives them the power to gather info on a new employee. While initiate a case allows them to start a case and alerts you with some of those case details. The initiate a case feature is an optional module. As you can see, this revamping of the client portal will give your clients a better understanding of what is needed for their case as well as a great overview of what has been completed on their case. This concludes our video on the updates to the client portal.